Hello there and welcome back to Let's Play Risen 2. I'm the RNG Genius, but you may call me Eric and in the last episode we turned in the um, the letter that we were supposed to bring to the pirates. Um, they are supposed to steal for, uh, to pay, they were supposed to pay for the um, sugar that got stolen. Of course, we are diplomatic. We intimidated a guy into giving me 300 gold, then we gave um, the, the 200 gold debt to Di Fuego, made in a, in a well, made uh, 100 gold there, and then we, we claimed our, our, um, our, our pay and got another 100 gold for fighting Rodriguez, Rodonald, no idea how that man is called. So that was that went well. Then we went up into the northern center of the map, which, yeah, we went to this toward this temple. We found a dead guy, Pete. He's lying around here. He was pretty dead. Now his corpse is gone, and he had a treasure map with him, a gigantic red X marked the spot where this rotten chest was buried and we got something very nice out of it because we got a legendary item the Meerschaum pipe it gives me firearms plus one which is very good because firearms plus one means more hit chance and more damage which is cool we also earned a lot of money here almost 1000 just for digging up this chest so that was great and now we're gonna head into this temple of course, I'm ready for traps and savages. Which there is only um, traps of right now. What's in this sarcophagus? Ruby ring. Dirty tricks plus five. Silver tongue plus five. Hi. <clears throat> Potion of persuasion. Man, that's good. Uh, I'll take the ruby ring. I'll equip the ruby ring instead of the ring I've got equipped right now. Because the glory plus 5% is not the best thing in the world. Instead, this ruby ring with silver tongue plus 5 is actually a nice addition to my stats right now. Because now I have silver tongue 35. Which in the end will net me probably more gold. Nothing. There's nothing here. That cannot possibly be quote unquote just a ruby ring. Yeah, you can climb up. Can Patty do the same is the question. And that's a yes, but she well, I, I don't think that classifies as a yes, she just ran up. Hey, that was surprisingly simple. What kind of traps could have possibly activated here? One. Another 500 gold. This is very easily earned money. Uh, why are you not able to climb up here? Oh, yes you are. Yes you are, it just didn't give me an input. Okay, we activated one set of traps. That set might have gotten activated around here as well. There is ghoul. You've got my back from way back. Okay. Now I should have yours. Hey, hey, attacking the wrong person. Nice kill on that ghoul. More claws. One sarcophagus. For one ghoul. Trait I gladly take. What's in here? I do like these sarcophaguses. 125, very valuable due to the gold alone. And another 110, and another 150. Ooh. Ooh, this is a little too nice right now. I'm getting, I'm getting absolutely greedy. Is that another idol? Uh, 
This has been a, a dope value proposition. Enemies? No. Very odd. Okay, this is this has to be an instant kill, right? There can only be so much greed, and the one slave did warn me about um, about what greed does to you. Okay, there's some. There's a lower region there. Is there ten ghouls? God, I want to fight it. I'm fighting the urge. Oh my goody gun drops. I don't want to fight it. I want to see what it can do. Guardian. Oh, she can drop down. She's gonna die in a second. Um, we're gonna use a grog. And provisions. That was not enough. How is Patty doing? Oh! Man, not in the front. Do that meteor strike. And by meteor strike, I mean overhead attack. Yeah, that one. Not against my friend. Oh! Okay. I get punished for, for being greedy here. I absolutely get punished. Two is enough, then he turns around. And that should... Nice! Holy guardian, Batman! One club. What's a club? Is that equipment? No. Loot. Club. 60. I took this from an undead guardian. Yeah, I, you better believe it. Leave her. My god. I I drank a grog, I admit that, but this was dope. Yeah. That was a temple I like. I didn't did not mean to slice thin air there. That was value. I got so much here. I just got 2000 gold. Plus those thousand there, that was 3,000 gold. That's a lot of skills. That's a lot of skills and I'll buy them. Investing in skills is a good value proposition. I will learn how to parry. Um, I will learn how to be a better thief or something. Persuasion is not worth. Fighting skills are better. What? kind of teachers did I already meet? I did not meet any voodoo teachers. I I could learn. Is that gunsmithing or does he does um, Barney teach me something about firearms as well? That's important. Barney. Start shooting. How do you become a gunsmith? Oh. You want to make guns, do you? Take skill, of course, and craftsmanship, too. I've got skill. I can learn a craft. Then Barney can teach you. It'll cost mine. Um, can you show me with this pistol? Can you show me with this pistol? Reckon I can, son. Nice. Pistol of my own. Show me how to make a critical hit. Can you show me how to blow someone's head off while I'm talking to them? 
Firearms two. I want to be a. I want to be quicker on the draw. I want to be quicker on the draw. Quicker on the what? Oh, quicker on the draw. Don't be thinking only of the next shot, stuffing in powder and bullet like a virgin in a hurry. Give all your attention to loading your pistol if you don't want to go off half cocked. Nice. Learned left handed. Teach me with this pistol. Teach me with this pistol. First thing you need to learn is to hold your nerve. Don't go blazing away like an inquisitor in a knocking shop. Wait till the last moment before you pull the trigger. Pistol doesn't have much of a range. Most times you'll only get one shot. So make your one shot count. That's what I'm trying to do here. Um, I don't want to make pistols of my own. Firearms 4. I want to be a better marksman. Don't have that kind of money right now. Show me what you've got. Do you need ammunition? Not right now. Let me sell my loot. Shovel, no. Bones are no. That, yes. Yes, no. Yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Can you show me with this pistol? Reckon I can? No, I want to learn. I, I want to see what I'm doing here first. And for that, I have to look in my inventory. What did I already learn? What did it do? And is it worth? Firearm skills. Left-handed. Cooldown time for pistols reduced significantly. Pistols 1. Increases talent, pistol talent by 5. Crits. Gives a chance to land critical hits and do an exceptional amount of damage. You can learn now. Enough said, allows you to end some dialogues immediately by a shot in the head? Ha! Huh. Gunsmith, marksman, doubles your chance of achieving critical hits with muskets and shotguns. Blazing barrels, shotgun time reduced, muskets, 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 shotguns, shotgun, shotgun, pistols, increased pistol talent by 10, by 15. What's my talent right now? 40. That's good. That is pretty good. Enough said is a skill that sounds awesome. And I've got 1,600. How do, much does that cost? Can you show me with this pistol? Reckon I can, son. Show me how to make a crit. Can you show me how to blow someone's head off while I'm talking to them? 500? Can you sure. show me how to blow someone's head off while I'm talking to them? Aye, that's a sneaky move, that is. What you want to do is distract your opponent. Wave your right hand in front of his face, then use your left to draw your gun and fire. Dirty, but it does the trick. <sighs> it's, that's so bad. Okay, that's nice. Now, what else do I want to do? I would like to get better at slashing things open. I would like to get better at cunning in general. Lock picking ideally. Make me a better thief. For gold, sure. Sure. Better a thief, cunning five. What does thievery do? Can we finish this later? What does thievery do? Skills, cunning. Thievery. Increase thievery talent by 10. Thievery. Required for picking locks and success of pickpocketing. It's for both. Okay, that's nice. Can you make me a better thief? For gold? Sure. Sure. I have 1,500. Maybe not. Not enough? I don't have cunning eight. I want to be a better thief. Picking locks or picking pockets. It's all about having the right soft touch. Practice with your hands. Then you'll see how much easier things get. Can we nice. Later? Okay. That was a huge value proposition. I don't have any more money. 
Yeah, that's right. I I earned the enough set skill. What you want? Blow off your head. Leave it out. Booze. De Fuego is not going to be a problem anymore. What'll that favor cost me? You can afford it. Ha! I'll bet you gave Pedro a good beating, and he gave you more than you needed for Di Fuego. So you've already pocketed your reward. But you're a lucky bastard, because I still feel generous. Five bottles of my finest Takariguan rum. Can't oh, say fair yeah, that. I'll consider that a reasonable you reward. Tongue? Learn anything else? Hmm. He seemed to think you should stop stealing his sugar. Bah, might as well try to stop a gnome picking from your pocket. We're not stopping. He should be glad we only take his sugar. Cheers. What does he teach? Teach me something. Like what? Um, painkillers last longer. Intimidation. 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 Toughness, bulletproof, eh. Nothing special. Nothing like the skills I have. I should be able to... Uh, this distraction thing will only work once, sadly. So let's see where he's sitting right now, because there is a way to get past him. Not in this situation. Um, that means where were the chests I wanted to pick? One is directly in Jack's Tower. I'm able to do that now with 45 lockpick. He don't know. Save game. Let's do this. What's in here? What? Oh, some of them are bigger. From what I can tell, it's just going to the to the absolute end and then uh, going up front. Huh. We get a scimitar. Better slashing weapon than what I... That's a better weapon. That's a better weapon. More elegant than the common saber. That's a better weapon, per se. Thieves ring, dirty tricks and thievery, plus ten. Mm. In some countries, even just wearing this ring is a crime. Hello, beautiful. Okay, um, we are absolutely equipping that scimitar. And we're absolutely equipping the thievery. Do you think I stole anything? Ah, some peace and quiet at last. I think so too. I think so too. Okay, we've got 50 stealing now. Everything is going as planned. Vasco, you had a thing I wasn't able to steal from. That was a mistake. That was a mistake, getting a chest of that caliber. Because it's useless. Oh god, it's the middle of the night, wait. Before I do anything stupid, that guy might just be standing behind me next time I do this. Okay, now observe. There is bigger stones, the bigger stones are in the middle, the smaller stones fall down faster, don't they? I cannot do it like that. I have to do it like this. Not working. That increases their height. Now that was a lot of fooling around for not much.
Vasco. If something goes missing, I'll know it was you. Uh, yeah. You you better check your stuff. It's dangerous keeping your stuff around at night, uh, at any time, or really. It's the middle of the night, which is good because in the middle of the night everyone is doing stuff. De Fuego is not at his chest. Is he getting toward his chest? Yes, he is. Yes, he do. No, he's going to sleep. Oh, 50 out of 60. The worst is that that almost worked. If I have 50 thievery, don't I have 45 pickpocketing as well? Oh man, yes I have. Yes, I do. Nice. Oh. Just dropped in, did you? I'll know who to is... blame if something goes missing. Well, you better ask your boss. You better ask your boss. Okay. No, I don't have time right now. All these guards have to go. All these guards have to go. You sit down and then you get up immediately again. Do. Sorry, mustache. Really? Is it just late evening instead of night? That guard is still outside. Is there one in here? No. Okay, I'm sorry that I'm basically safe stating here, but um, there is only this possibility. This These games are strange. Well, that worked out. Torch, Ritual Potion, Gold, nothing special, nothing special. Don't try anything else. I wouldn't. Anything else, he said. Nice. I wonder how to distract these guy guards. With you. I wonder any other chests I wasn't able to pick. Yeah, the one right uh, to the up, like, I, I, I know where it is. I just don't know how to say where it is. It's the middle of the night. That sucks. Um, we had to kill a ghoul, and then we got to a chest, and that was locked. Come to think of it, there was one in the southeast as well. One that was locked and I was really angry having gotten having fought all my way down there and um, Then coming across a locked chest and now I've forgotten all about those chests that were in those places This is a pretty good situation to use a torch It was right around here there was a ghoul oh No pick up that torch I thought I could attack with a torch. That's what I was trying to test here. Ghoul is no more. And there is his chest. Able to pick that. For the first time I don't have to quick save. Okay. No. This, this, and this. No clue how that works. No clue. But it does. Fencing foil. <clears throat> Piercing weapons. 20 to 50. This well-balanced blade is frequently used in duels. So, um, on average, this will do... Um, 35 damage and mine will do 35 damage as well. But with piercing weapons, no, it it yields an increase in piercing weapons plus 10, and my scimitar has slashing weapons plus 15. So if I if my piercing weapons and slashing weapons st stat are on exactly the same level, then the scimitar is superior. Jade earring, black magic, grog, gold goblet. Um, attributes. 
Slashing weapons is the scimitar, scimitar plus 15. So they are all on the same level, meaning that my scimitar is superior in terms of damage. Slashing weapons tell increases damage inflicted by sabers as well as melee attack damage using a musket without a bayonet. Without a bayonet and piercing weapons using a musket with a bayonet. Okay. Officer's pistol and pistol one plus five there. Cool. Blade proof. Basically everything gives me stuff here. That is nice. That is a good sword. I have not... Interesting that attack animation is different. I think the weapon is quicker as well, which is a huge upgrade. If, the, if that weapon is indeed quicker, then um, it's gonna be very, very convenient. Okay, one more chest. Um, the other one was in the southeast, but I assume that later on I'll have to go down there again anyways, and then I don't have to do it right now, because that area was actually quite tough to be in. There were a lot of there were a lot of giant curbs, and if I have to go down there again, I don't want to do it at night. I absolutely do not want to do it at night. I have raw meat. I'm just gonna drop this. Put that thing away. Have him. Don't do it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Curtis. You can hit me. No. 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 Can't have that. Where's my last save? I have a torch in hand that cannot be that long past. What kind of weapons do I have in my inventory? I just have to look that up. Uh, we're going right in here. Okay, so I have not picked that lock yet. Okay, pick that thing. Is it the absolute same lock? Nope, of course it's not. Yes, it is. I just forgot the, the, the order. Same loot, and then we can fast travel up here. Pirates then. Nice. Before we continue, and of course the next thing is boarding this pirate ship, because I don't know much else. Uh, actually winning this game against Mr. McFatman, um, that would yield another quest. Could try that again a couple of times before I end the episode here. Okay, as my stakes for the map, I'll put up. A monkey, a black pearl, a bottle of rum. I don't have a monkey. A bottle of rum. For a treasure map? Two bottles of rum? Gift wrapped in your skid mark stained undies? A black pearl. An earring? It's not worth as much as the map. But since I'm gonna win, I'll let it slide. Get yourself a painkiller and let's get started. Okay. This is so gonna fail. Drink for the map. All right, let's drink for the map. First, get yourself a painkiller. What's a painkiller? Great rum. Can I have more? Of course. I have 304. That should be enough for one painkiller. Jesus. I am so gonna retry this. Okay. I, I'm so gonna reload this. All right. Let's drink for the map. Oh, oh, you can hardly wait to lose, can you? I hope you can't hold us liquor. Let's go. Okay, one more, one more. No, he's drinking his last one. No! Next time, mate. You lose. I knew you were no drinker. I'll be taking my winnings now. 
Okay, I'm ready. That's it. I'm out. Hmm. Not the auto. God. Is that the reloaded auto save? The saved auto. Okay. Hmm. Let me let me actually try this as often as I can and then we will just go ahead and skip to the part where I actually win the thing without any commentary. I will put this blanket away so I'm actually better at it. This might take five or ten minutes. Great, Rob. Can I have more? But I don't want to have this on record because I'm gonna fail so many times and it's just gonna be reloading again and again and again and again and again. So I and I'm not losing my black pearl. That's uh, that's for sure certain here. Okay, I'm gonna save the game here. I'm gonna be right back. You'll see something, and then we are going to talk again. Let's go. Oh bollocks! Nice. Yes. Uh, I'll be having my map then. I must be losing my touch. A deal's a deal. Here you go. And my stakes back? Oh, aye, right you are. You fight as well as you drink, and you'll be welcome aboard. Okay, I'm ready. That's it. I'm out. Man, you don't want to know that how long that took. You don't. Okay, I'm happy. I just got the map and um, logbook. Takarigua. Hmm. 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 What? 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 Where's my? Where's my treasure map? The clothes of a pirate. Can't believe that still that still is not finished. O'Brien's treasure. Ah, that's that quest. O'Brien buried treasure on Takarigua. I need the map. O'Brien is ready to drink for the map if my contribution is right. So I now have the map. Is that it? So I should have that map now. Let's see if I can just look at it. No, is it on the C chart? Uh, I'm gonna figure this out. For the moment, I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope I will see you in the next episode as well. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.